रुपेश क्या तुम अपनी पूरी जिंदगी वीडियो गेम्स खेलकर बिताना चाहते हो Pays to play. to play to play to play.
Hello. Okay, guys, we are back into the game. Sorry for the delay and sorry for no sound issue. We are back into the game, and you can see our Bisanko already moving forward with fourth place. This is second round of the game, Aru, because we're winning the first round for the Splash Squad. Uh, first lobby and we are moving forward slowly slowly into that positions rule breaker holding down shanku as you can see already in the say back scout dpop they bang and the players are trying for moves move, fearless getting knocked down shanku almost getting knocked down and killed too by the op he's moving forward slowly so not still not dead two players of the rp are down fearless is gone shanku is gone they bang and shant are getting knocked down and now shant is the only player left he's hiding inside the house can he survive this one four versus one this is going to be a lot of trouble for him moving forward the zone is coming in and he's also getting knocked down by yahi and this is the round one gone of that team of that players and let's go now moving forward though yahi is already here 12 seconds till the third round first round the other place getting forward though it's looking pretty good no issues from that all that whole ordeal and we are going forward though in the third round of first lobby there will be three lobbies in total by the way for this tournament uh let's see how this one goes actually so second round third round moving forward one one score uh, score line moving forward though blouse black spot already here and they bang and the team is already here moving forward though all the players together from the orange side meanwhile the blue side is trying to hold on to their resources hold on to their angles trying to cover them from the, all the angles basically and seeing what they can do with that but still it's an unlimited mode uh, unlimited ammo mode so there's literally a lot of coins a lot of dollars and everybody can just waste as much money as they And now we're going to move forward with that thing. They bang. Yeah, he all plays already here. Moving forward slowly, slowly though. They bang. Let's see what they can do right now. Everybody just putting down blue walls right now. There's not much engage coming forward from that angle, that old side. But hopefully we'll be seeing the action coming forward in that mean in that run. Now moving forward, the blood scout still here into that engage. Moving forward, Dick OP is already ready. And players are engaged. They want throwing the grenade onto his so he's alone, surrounded by three players. Oh, and the glue wall and the shield coming forward and getting that's getting him the one free kill. That is pretty good. He was surrounded by three players and he still got the one kill. Devang is a really good player in that position. Moving forward, though, everybody surrounded Lakshu surrounding onto the orange side. Dick OP uh, getting knocked down. Lakshu Black Scout are the last two players left for the team. Blue Team Blue, Black Shot getting knocked down, almost still alive. Three, uh, three versus two, three versus one, almost. Luxu is knocked down, as you can see. Luxu is Luxu got killed, and so did the Black Shot. And orange side of Rule Breakers getting one more point for this lobby. Let's see who finish this one and who actually win this one in the end. This is going to be really, really interesting, guys. Moving forward, though, we are still into the game when we are almost ready to hop into the interesting part of the game 12 seconds though 12 seconds till the game will start up and we'll be start having fun now one second till the game is goes live and we are back into the game root breakers moving forward slowly into the it's a factory map though this is going to be interesting let's see if they can do this one yahi the p and everybody holding on this is a fast pace fast action game all the players ready into the position they're uh, they're going from the top side this is interesting on the floor shanku is moving forward there's a lot of blue walls used and shanku is surrounded by four players can he do this and no indeed he gets surrounded by four players and getting destroyed shanku getting getting this all early on and root breaker losing one of their players three versus four right now all the players are surrounded that area and they are very far away from each other sorry they're close together but the blue side is far away and blue side is holding on to the inside but right now the orange side has to engage on to the players or onto that position but they can't do this one let's see whatever they can do right now holding on to that angle can the smart please this situation can they actually just hold on to their angles and just get those engages from the long distance because if they are forced to move in they are in a lot of trouble because there's already outnumbered because of shanku getting killed early on into the into this round this is looking really bad for rule because right now but these sport is ready and these sports are ready to go down rule because fearless Fearless is already here. Devang is already here. Holding on to the Zangles. Fearless is very close to the other side of the blue team. And they are coming up towards him. One versus two. And Fearless getting knocked down. But also, uh, Lakshu is also getting knocked down. Will this happen though, Shant? Fearless alone. He knocked down. Shant also getting down. And now Devang is the last player for the team. He's in a very, very bad situation. And he got Dikopi though. He's going to get one more kill at least. 
but this is not looking good for them at all. And now Devang alone in a 1v3 situation. One more play getting knocked on. Devang is doing actually pretty good. Can he get this one though? Two players left and no. Yahi getting that kill and Devang is out of this game. And so, all the, both of the teams got two points each. This is looking really good. Round of five and we are back into it. Let's see. Let's hope everybody go, everything goes good and into that, this round of the map. Yahi. Already holding on to those angle 13. Let's see, let's see how this one goes. This is looking really, really interesting though. As you can see, KD a leaderboard. Yahi is leading with the four kills from the team uh, team D Esports. And from the team red side, there is a tie between Devang and Shanko. So let's see if he can continue this fast pace action coming forward. A lot of blue was again getting used and a lot of resources being engaged upon but the blue side is pretty far away and pretty spread apart and right now I'm pretty sure right side, uh, orange side won't make the same mistake they did last time and which they literally just uh, did the one player just rushed into the all four player and that was a really bad situation but hopefully they will be like staying together and rotating around and blue side player is getting hurting down Luxo is almost getting knocked down and Shantanu is moving forward with that position and can he kill this one and he is knocked down very good and very good engage from Shantanu and Luxo almost getting killed but running away from the other side and OP oh my god what is happening there's a lot of coming forward but no right side is in trouble again and Shanku, Shanku is the last player alive. Can he win this one? He got one more, one person knocked down but not killed. And he is already dead in the end. Oh, both of the teams are playing with each other in a very clear position. Like one team wins one round, another team wins another. And 3-2 is the scoreline. Can, can Blue Side finally get their lead onto this match? And show us what they are made of and like totally moving forward with that thing. One second and we are back into the game round number five and blue side is already here and getting engaged on Devang is here, Shanko is here, Shantanu fearless. Let's see what we can do with this one. Deco P moving forward, Luxo is also here, Yahi fearless and everybody moving on to the position. Luxo P take and they have been getting engaged upon orange side to getting staying together trying to stay away but Shantanu but one person is away which is Devang he's trying to stay away but now he's coming forward with that position we are back into the caped uh, midtown area in the map and the Kopi almost getting knocked down getting a lot of engaged a lot of damage onto him but Shanku is still alive and he is also still alive by the way the Kopi is still alive and he's alone in the very unfavorable position. Oh no, he's not alone. Big shot. Black scout. Black shot was already on his right hand side, holding on to that position. So let's see what will happen this time, guys. And three to one is the score line. Now moving forward, the luxury is still here. And let we move forward with that. Fearless is here. Fearless is getting caught alone in that position. This is not looking good for him. And they're surrounded by blue walls. They can't even help him. And two players from the blue right side are down. Devang and Shanku are the last two players left for their team. And Devang is kind of stuck down in that position. Not favorable at all. And he's getting knocked down and almost killed. And so this Shantan new and 4-2 is the scoreline. And blue side winning the first lobby of the Clash Bar tournament. And guys, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back in five minutes with the second lobby. Just back to back games, plays. We'll be back with the action. Hold on to those seats and just wait for us. Thank you. If you're going to go through the score lines, we can see 42 is the score. And Team Blue is for the Esports winning this one. But the first round, and we'll be back with the second lobby as soon as we can. So don't go anywhere, guys, and stay there. <laughs> क्या तुम अपनी पूरी जिंदगी वीडियो गेम्स खेलकर बिताना चाहते हो? Chill mom. What do you mean chill? Am I a fridge or what? I'm going to call your dad now. I don't know what to do with this. <gasps> what are you doing? Working, working. Yes, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, yes, yes. Pays to play.
जिंदगी वीडियो गेम्स खेलकर बिताना चाहते हो to play Hello guys, we are back into the game as you can see, and this is row lobby number two for the Clash Squad event, and all the same play teams on the same place are already back into the as you can see, and we're gonna be starting up very very soon. Uh, this is a trial period. I think this is a trial period, not the ex oh, this is the exact round. We are starting up as soon as we can. Okay, right here, moving forward, the orange team is staying together, trying to stay close to each other. As you can see, Devon, Shantanu, Shankar, all the players are already here. If you go through the highway, you can see they're holding onto those edges, holding onto those how. Those houses. Meanwhile, if you go to the other team's side, black or blue side is going to one two players hiding on the one this side, and other two players overall from the other side holding on to the engage, getting Yahi getting locked down, getting lot of damage taken from that area. Yahi in lot of trouble, but they are still trying to engage onto those players. Yahi and Black Scout holding onto their corners. A lot of blue walls getting used, but not much coming forward from any side. Luxor holding on. All the players trying their best. Now moving forward though, let's see whatever happens here. Yahi, Shantanu, one the players trying their best. But this is not looking that good, interestingly. Yahi getting destroyed with his blue wall. But this is not looking good for the election. Moving forward though. Yeah. Oh, what what was that? That was a very close shot. And Black Scout getting knocked down. He's still there. Can Shantanu kill him though before anything happens? But nothing coming from and Shantanu. Always so very, very low. Scout shout Black Scout getting killed easily. And the cop is also very, very low. Shantanu is almost getting knocked down. Yeah, he is knocked down. And one we one is right there in that we visit the OP and the and the Luxu. Luxor is getting knocked down. Yahi getting one more team. And Howlers or Rule Breakers getting for their first win, first round win for the for the lobby number two. As you can see, the the team D Sport won their first round. So it will be really interesting to see how they will move forward and come back with that. Now second round will be starting in a few seconds. We will be going live with that. So let's see whatever happens here. And let me just say, quickly go through the seaside. I will say you know, that as you can see, the place were over there, all the place over there with their angles, and they will be moving forward. Now, when they are in the position, I will be telling you where they are exactly holding on. And you can see the strategy is doing forward. I think the blue side is the only team who's kind of following the strategy here. As you can see, they are right now, they are 2 2 following 2 2 strategy, like two players going pushing forward, two players just holding on. It's a very smart strategy. Meanwhile, as you can see, but the right side now they're spread apart but normally they follow one simple strategy which is staying together and it's also very special and very, could be really useful at least but now moving forward though a lot of blue was used a lot of engages coming forward though plays out here into that position shantanu shanku and they're taking advantages of the boxes but now shanku <laughs> triple crew wall onto his position wow smart decision let's see whatever happens here everybody somebody's key to die actually in this position but now moving forward the players are here i am here let's move forward with this position one minute till the game finishes till this round starts shrinking and goes down now the players are here this i engage already i think you know shanku and black sword are very very close to each other but still there's a lot of distance between each other and so is dick dickopi and yahi Let's see whatever they can do in this position. Uh, CKOP and Yahi. Uh, fearless. Fearless is engaged. And Shanku trying to engage onto the position. But Blue was already in that area. What are they trying to do actually? There is, you can see Fearless and Shanku holding onto the behind the Blue Walls. Black Sword and CKOP are over there towards the left hand side. And Devang and other players already here. Yahi moving forward now. Lakshu and Shantanu moving forward in that position. PL is getting knocked down, not looking good for them. Shantanu Devang is also getting knocked down. Red team in trouble, as you can see. Shanku, Shantanu, and this is not looking good for them at all. Moving forward, the Black Scout is. Oh, Shantanu is alive? 
still alive, still kicking actually. And Shantar is knocked out. Shantar is the last player alive, and Team R B losing this one. And blue sky, blue side of Team D coming forward with that win. So one was four line, very uh, very uh, back and forth game coming forward. Both, both the teams, both of them showing that they are they are, are eligible to be the finalists, and then fun coming forward with this thing and coming forward and just pushing through as much as they can so let's move forward with this one now moving forward with the yahi devang shantanu shantu hope is already here so i'm just going to the z side camera as you can see black start moving forward with that area they're in away from anybody else they can't do much as you can see but fuel is shanku are only already in the position and they are pushing they're pushing as much as they can try to do this one but now Okay, not much happening. Devang is holding on. That is a very close shot. And nothing coming up. Black Scout and Luxury knocked on early on. Uh, CKOP is also knocked on. And last page, team, his team, Yai, and he is very, very far away. Can he help his teammates? A lot of was used. He maybe can help his team. But DCOP is nearly not killed. And the other team is already here. Yahi, Luxu are still alive. But very, very low. Black Scout is already getting knocked down. He's pretty much not going to survive this one. And red side are on to them from that high place, trying their best to get them and kill them. Shantanu literally getting into them and trying to kill them all. Luxus still alive. Shantanu getting knocked down. Not in a good position. Why didn't you just throw the grenades onto them? This would be just an easy kill. But this is how it's going right now. And you can see Luxus still fighting onto this place. He's solo 1v3, but he's still trying his best to help his teammate. But that didn't come forward to his success. And now coming forward, third round, Team Rule Breakers on the lead right now, and Sentosa is the third, was the fourth round of this lobby. Now we're going forward though, 14 seconds till the next one, and they are very far away from each other, but this is going to be a really good positioning, hopefully, we will be going down. Deepan, Shantanu, Shantu, feel is always still here. Black Scout, Soapy, Lex, as you can see, they are still following the team strategy. 2 2, split apart. Black Scout and OP move forward. Lexi and. Oh, they're starting with a different one right now. One in the middle, two for the right, and one for the left alone. And it so, looks like the team uh, on side is also following the same strategy, repeating and respecting each other immensely but now we follow the slowly story Shantanu is here he's ready to engage the two is right in front of him but they are surrounded with the house yeah he's getting knocked down early on I don't know how okay there's a long range knockdown onto Yahi there's another looking good on blue side they might lose one more round right now DCOP getting oh getting knocked down too Luxo also getting knocked down Black Sword is the last player in life for the the esports and he's in trouble looks like it as of now and a lot of damage coming forward to Black Star, and he is also getting knocked down. Third win for this from this lobby by Team Rule Breakers. They are demolitioning the other team, demolishing the other team, and showing this thing. If they win this more, this one, this round too, they will be easily qualifying. They will be easily getting this one, and they will be forcing down the third round of the map for the other team. Else. If, the, if somehow the esports come back from this and win this, to, win this round and other forward, they will be they will be no third round in the rule because the esports will basically win this tournament. But now moving forward though, as you can see, they bunch and will be moving forward slowly, slowly. But meanwhile, blue side as blue side as you can see are still into the position. Now that these very close to each other now, a lot of blue walls are being used. And you can see right now a lot of engagement initially coming forward. Shanku getting knocked down. This is not looking good for them. Blue side is here. Shanku is killed. And the blue red side, orange side is not having a good time with this round. And one more down. Shantanu is in the one of the last players left. Not good engage. And DCOP, CKOP letting, not getting killed. Shantanu is dead now. Devang is the last player alive on with a shotgun. Can he come this one? Can he win this? Okay, but trying to finesse his way out. But at least in the end, getting killed by the gun of Yahi. And now... Fifth, sixth map of the game, match point for the team, uh, team rule breakers. If they win this one, this pretty much an easy victory for an easy lobby win for this them, and then they will be forcing the third third lobby third map onto the other team. Let's move forward with this one. Six seconds till the game starts, and we are going to be going live very very soon, and we are back. 
as you can see uh, Jahi OP Black Scout uh, looks to all the players already here and as you can see in the map though from the heaven area four players spreading about two one two and from the other side though they are spread they're trying to stay together they're just trying to stay, stay close but Devang is now questioning alone and he this is not looking good for him honestly I'm just gonna be honest this is not looking good for him there is a lot of engages coming forward though and the maps and also the glue walls but no proper engage fearless Shangu, Shantanu, Devang, all the places still here. Now let's go to the other side. Black Scout, CK, Luxu, Yahi, and OP. Let's move forward with that. Yahi, Black Scout, CK, OP, Luxu, Yahi. Now moving forward, though, there's still no engage yet. Proper one. And now they're waiting for the time. One minute. So the proper fully functioning engage. Let's see whatever happens here. Select you moving forward. Nobody's engaged right now. Team is pretty much stagnant right up now. We win this kind of just wins the game. It wins the lobby basically. And they let's see if the orange team wins. There's going to be a third map, and if blue team somehow manages to beat them and force the seven map, the full seven map, then it's going to be a really interesting game. Let's see whatever happens here now. Devon, uh, now blue side moving forward, can kill them all. PLS, Shanku. Shanku getting knocked down. Orange side is in trouble. CKOP moving forward. Shantanu is dead. And Yahi moving forward. One versus one versus Devon. Can he win this one or not? Black Sword almost getting knocked down. A lot of damage coming from his way. But he survived somehow in a 1v2 situation. Yahi and Seeker in a very close combat situation. Can they win this one? One versus two. And Orange team winning the lobby and forcing on to the third map. Third lobby of this tournament. Congratulations, Rule Breakers, for winning this lobby. And now moving forward with the third one. Let's start this one as soon as we can. So don't go anywhere, guys. Let's go through the scoreboards and then we'll be moving forward with the third lobby. Third in the final lobby of the tournament. Whoever wins this basically wins the game, actually. So right now, Orange Team, 4 was 4 to 2. These would seek OP, Lakshu, and Yahi. Seek um, Yahi with the killing with the kill lead of 5. And from the other side, there's Rube, Devang, Shantanu, Shanku, and Fearless. Fearless with the 6 kills lead. Now, let's move forward. We'll be starting up the third lobby as soon as we can. So, guys, don't go anywhere and we'll be back. Drish, do you want to play video games in your whole life? Chill, mom. What do you mean, chill? Am I a fridge or what? I'm going to call your dad now. What to do with this? <gasps> What are you doing? Working, working. Yes, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Yes, yes, yes. Yes! It pays to play. Chill, mom. What do you mean, chill? Am I a fridge or what? I'm going to call your dad now. I don't know what to do with this. <gasps> what are you doing? Working, working. Yes, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Yes, yes, yes. Yes! It pays to play. And welcome guys, we are back into the game. Let's see whatever happens here. 
Now moving forward, though, we are going to be having having a lot of time, a lot of fun with this one. Now, all the players are here, all the games are here, so let's move forward with that thing. Now, first round of the third lobby. Whoever wins this lobby is going to be winning this tournament, basically. So let's move forward with that thing. Z positions, now we are back into the game. All the four players from the blue side are spread apart. They're trying their best to be as far away from each other as they can. And from the right side, they are also following, trying to follow the same thing, but now... All from the other players are moving towards the Chantanou side. All the players are here. Into that area. Black Scout. Black Shout. And other players are here in the, in those positions. And now. Black Shout. Shanku. They bond. Uh, no proper engage coming forward. There were a lot of shots. There were a lot of noises. But not a proper engage yet. Shanku and Devang are feel this holding onto that positions. They are very close to each other. And they could be engaged coming forward in very, very soon. Now moving forward though, the map is here. And this is a really nice position. This is observatory area. And Lakshu getting almost knocked on when initially on the first map. This is looking really, really interesting. But nothing much coming forward from that area. Shantaru is ready. Shantaru is ready to kill right now. Holding on to those positions now. Move forward the Devang is here. Shout out. Yahoo loud. Shot nothing much about nobody dying. There's a lot of engages, a lot of kills, and a lot of healing coming forward. But yeah, the engage is finally here. As you can see, uh, and fearless shout Lakshu Yahi Yahi trying to kill this place. A lot of action coming forward. The DCOP getting knocked down, the Black Scout getting knocked down, and they are getting knocked almost Shantanu getting knocked down. And Black Scout is alone in that position. Lakshu and Yahi are the last two players from the the esports they are getting almost kills down there in a very unfavorable position Luxo is almost in the lockdown and last but yeah he is alive holding on to his position trying to kill this but no and the double kill coming forward from the field is inside and they win this two win this round <laughs> round number one of the third lobby won by rule breakers now we are moving forward with the second one second one of seven Let's see whoever can win this one. This is going to be really, really interesting, guys. I just don't know how far we can go with this one. We are moving forward with this one. Shantanu, fearless. Let's go to the disease side right now. So, uh, fearless and Shantanu will move forward with that position. Shantanu from the middle and Devan from the right hand side. And from the other side of the blue side, we can see Black Star, uh, three days are in the middle area. And one is going forward from the other side. Now, moving forward, engaging on the Ethiopia's over here. And the Ethiopia's already into the area, into the house. They are ready to engage on. But the other side is running away right now. We're holding on to the open areas. But let's see whatever happens here. DCOP, Devang, Shantanu, TLS, Shanku. Let's see whatever happens here. Now, both players, both teams are ready. They are trying their best. Can they win this one though? And right now, both teams, both the players are already into the positions. Let's see whatever happens here. Now, Black Sol, Devang, Shanku, TLS. No engage coming forward as of right now. But they are very close to each other. As you can see, DC OP is literally inches away from the other player. Fearless is coming on to that position. Yeah, he is ready. Holding on. But there's the entrance way is blocked by the by the blue walls and they are not going away anytime soon and yeah he is holding on to the corner blue walls might have actually go away pretty soon but yeah they are gone actually and there's a one one engage two v two engage coming forward from that area here is holding on to his position yeah he's holding on to the position and another blue wall and they just run away from the other way the way they didn't come from and basically that is what happened nobody is ready to engage one we've done this a lot of blue walls engaged a lot of resources being used map is now shrinking everybody is close to each other whatever ever happens this is going to be really really important and the cop are getting knocked down and shantanu getting knocked down and the esports in a lot of trouble again can really rule breaker esports win this tournament this is looking really really close right now what is happening ckop Lakshu, yahi black shout and uh, Wait, what happened? Howlers won. So, right side actually won this one. That was a very close fight. But in the end, due to the map and due to the... Res Wait, there was a tie? So, I think the map gave it a tie. So, I think the map gave it a tie. So, there's nobody won thus that round. But we will follow the next one. Eight seconds till the next round starts. So, don't go anywhere, guys. We will be right there. <laughs>
Now I'm going to the divine is here, Shantanu is here, Shanku feel as all the base are putting on, trying to factor in the positions, right, the kills and every single thing they can. Factory position from the Z side, the COP and the police are already here. Four versus four, they are all in the same similar position, all close to each other. Can they win this one or not? I'm really not sure. The COP always in that area, Lexi moving forward with the Black Scout, Black Shout, and the area is ready. Can they do this one or not? I'm not sure. Fearless Shandanu, Yahi, Tibang, Shanku, Fearless. Nobody's doing anything as of now. Moving forward slowly, slowly though. And as you can see, map, they are pretty spread apart from the distance. And this is not looking that good. Nobody is ready to engage on, they're very close to each other, just inches away, and in one minute the map will be shrinking, and somebody has to force in, force and engage, else they will they basically just be wasting time, and they will die eventually with the zone coming forward, but now the players are ready, and there might be engage coming on to the blue side, blue side may be in trouble, if they don't go to the teammates close by, oh no, Black Spout, Black Spout almost getting covered down, Alone, this is not looking good for him. He might die easily. Yes, as you can as you can see, what two one versus two black star is dead as I predicted. And without the team, Devang is here. Black OP, Shantanu, Lakshu, Shanku is dead too. Knocked down right now, not that exactly. And Shantanu is out. Blues are coming back from the four, three to four, three versus four. And the fearless is almost getting knocked down. What is this? This is a very close one. And the bank is caught. And blue side getting that round win. Two to one is the scoreboard. Is the scoreboard as of now? But now the third round will be coming forward very very soon. Now let's just see whatever they can do. Black shout. Black shoe Yahi. OP. Moving forward, this is looking really, really interesting. Everybody is engaging on to each other. Shantra Blue side is very, very down right now. Let's see whatever happens here. And everybody is in looks in a lot of trouble right now. Black Scout. Shantra. Shantra. And Rule Breakers might actually win this one. This is looking very, very close. Two versus two. But Rubikus has a lot of less health compared to the Black Sword and Yahi. Black Sword and Yahi onto the platform and maybe engaging coming forward though. And Yahi getting one more down. Devang is and last one now. Can he win this? He got double and all the players are done. Now moving forward though, third, so fourth round actually for the ma fifth round actually for the for this lobby. Let's see who will win this one. Blue side actually coming forward with the with the close one. <laughs> moving forward though, fearless, Shivan, Shantanu, Shanku. Oh, so red side is all be here and they're close to each other two from the two from the front one from the back and one away from each other Yahi is their main killer and he's very far away from everybody he's holding on to this position maybe waiting for the end whenever it happens and he can just engage on in the end and try and just kill everybody one minute 20 seconds till the first initial initial map will be closing down now we're moving forward Lakshu, black spout okay Yahi Uh, 
Watchout, TCKOP, Yahi and the Bang. CKOP is very close to each other and Yahi getting knocked down. He is that's a really good engage and the Bang is also getting knocked down. Blue side is moving forward with the Shantanu is very far away. Shanku is here, injured and engaged. Can he actually win this? When Shanku is getting down to Shantanu is the last player alive for the red side. He's very far away from each other, and DC Kopi getting him to down 4 to 1. Blue side winning this one. Congratulations, Team D Sports finalist and the winners of this tournament. Congratulations, guys. And, guys, we'll see you back into the BR finals very, very soon. So, don't go anywhere. Now, let's just look at the scores right now 4 to 1. For highest skill from the Rubriker side is Devon and Shantanu. And from the from the Warbingers D side D sport side is Yahi. We'll see you back with in no chance with the with the BR matches. So don't go anywhere and thank you. Drish, kya tum apni puri zindagi video games khel kar bitana chahte ho? Chill, mom. What do you mean chill? Am I a fridge or what? I'm going to call your dad now. I don't know what to do with this. <gasps> what are you doing? Working, working. Yes, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Yes, yes, yes. Yes! It pays to play. Chill, mom. What do you mean, chill? Am I a fridge or what? I'm going to call your dad now. I don't know what to do with this. <gasps> what are you doing? Working, working. Yes, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Yes, yes, yes. Yes! It pays to play. to play. It 
pays to play. Play. 